What's the best way to wrap up a conversation with someone who will not stop talking? I had a classmate with autism and when he felt like the conversation was finished he would just walk away. Didn't matter if you were still talking directly to him. I have an immense amount of respect for that guy. Sorry to cut you short, but you've got more talk than I've got time. This requires a certain amount of impoliteness. But then again they're also very impolite. Unpolite. By not stopping their convo. Like others already said. Tell them you have to go. Turn and walk away. But something that I found most helpful is. Keep walking. Even if they keep talking to you. Maybe throw up a hand as a wave. But whatever you do keep your back to them and keep walking away. Good luck. People like that are demon spawn ISTG they're here to make life hell for others. Just state how you feel at the moment. Example 1, I'm hungry. Asterisk walk away. Example 2, I'm tired. Asterisk walk away. Example 3, I'm horny. Asterisk walk towards them. All of them should end the conversation promptly. I have to return some videotapes. Well, I'm gonna let you go. I like to keep a cheap USB drive on me for moments like this. I get dozens of them at trade shows and never use them. Write something cryptic on it like Marseille Jungle Book or Vanilla 15 inches. As soon as you get the sense that the person is going to talk your ear off. Start looking around periodically as if you're watching for someone. Look out a window. At another part of the crowd, anywhere you might recognize someone from a bit of a distance. Mutter, shit, under your breath and interrupt the person. Say something like, listen. I don't have much time. And I cannot tell you how important this is. But for your sake and mine. I need to leave this with you and get out of here quickly. Attempt to hand them the drive. Thanks to Hollywood. The effect here is strongest if you take the drive out from an inside jacket pocket or a small ladies clutch. Most people won't take it. And at this point they likely won't want to talk to you anymore. If they do take the drive. Say to them, my country is indebted to you. Please keep the device safe. We can never speak again. You'll be hearing from the cherry orchard, then walk away briskly. Looking over your shoulder. Knock them out. Frantically pick up your phone and say you're sorry you really have to go. I don't know if it's still around. But there was an Android app at one time that would ring your phone in 10 or 30 seconds or something if you pressed the volume button a few times quickly. Even if the phone was asleep. Reach into your pocket. Adjust the volume. Continue your conversation for a bit. Then excuse yourself to take the phone call. Sorry, can I just stop you there, then say nothing else. Slap your knees and say, Welp. My family and I were out walking our dog recently. We bumped into a lady who said our dog reminded her of her dog that died last year. We made sympathetic noises for a bit and then started to make the kind of noises and movements to wrap up the conversation and move on. And she just kept on talking. And talking. And talking. Her husband had wandered off already. I guess he knew where this was going. After five minutes I wandered off. My wife, who is generally a nicer person than me, stayed and listened a bit more. The kids started to wander off after me. And eventually my wife just shrugged. Started to wander off too with this woman still talking as if we were still there. She was still talking to nobody at all until we drifted out of earshot. Sorry to cut you off but I actually got a run. I'll talk to you later. And just walk away immediately. Continue the conversation but start walking toward the door. 
they should follow you without thinking, then just escort them out the door and voila. Do this all the time to contractors that come in my shop and have a thousand stories. Suddenly gasp, yell, my souffle. And dash out of the room. Point and act like there's something behind them and when they look away run as fast as you can. Move your index finger slowly to their mouth as you softly say. Shush. You'll get all sorts of reactions. It's great. I ran into an old friend at an outdoor market. Who then proceeded to talk non-stop for the next 10 minutes. As we walked through the crowd. As we reached some other friend of his. And he finally turned away and started talking to them. I just turned around and walked away. I don't think he noticed. On the phone. I simply hang up and turn my phone off for 7 minutes. Later I say it died.